Hello and welcome to the Canvas Layouts comparison video. As you watch this video, you will learn more about the differences in the three layouts provided in Canvas Commons. We have the Advanced Layout, Foundational Layout, and the Quick Start Layout. Let's learn. The first layout is the Advanced Layout. This layout offers a unique, enhanced design that makes it stand out from the rest while also including a refined one-week module placeholder. Next, we have the foundational layout. This layout does away with the enhanced design and sticks to the basics. You'll find a customized welcome, robust course components, and 16 weeks of modules. Lastly, there is the quick start layout. This layout is intended to give you full creative power to execute your course build vision while still providing essential course components accompanied by three-week module placeholders. Adding some more clarity to the inner workings of these layouts, we'll spend time exploring a high overview. In this segment, we will focus on the navigational hierarchy the content placeholders supplied in each module, and the visual design elements. Beginning with the advanced layout, there are six modules listed. The first one we see is the administrator module. This module is simply communicating that Canvas has a license for the design. It is not meant to be published to the students, and there's even tutorials inside in case you would like to take a peek at those. We next have the instructor module. The instructor module provides resources necessary to be proficient in the Canvas layout. Although not devised as a Canvas pathway, this module serves as a helpful guide when first navigating through the layout. Getting started is where students are directed when they first are introduced to your course. This helpful resource provides a course overview, information about the instructor, class resources, required textbooks, netiquette, FAQs, a student lounge, and a place to ask the instructor questions. Resources and support offer students support service information and links to useful online resources for their convenience. Everything from technical support, Canvas support, accessibility, and the student support cultural resources, institutional policies, and the Lockdown Browser Software Support Guide. Now we enter the first weekly module of your course. This module is packed with the necessary items to structure your course. The weekly module contains the following. Week 1 Overview and Objectives, To-Do List, Supplemental Resources, Week 1 Lecture, Week 1 Reading, a week one review and weekly assignments. The weekly assignments contain individual group assignments, a review, and a knowledge check. Lastly, we recommend utilizing the course conclusion module. Consider this module your opportunity to summarize outcomes, credentials, and perhaps even ask your students a survey. Something unique to the advanced layout is the design elements. The multicolored scheme invites students to a clear visual separation of content and hierarchy. Further, icons have been included to further convey a clear distinction of content through the course. Another excellent feature about the advanced layout is that it includes three home pages. Take a moment to look over the various home pages. These are a great way to give a professional look to your course. The foundational layout provides much of the same content as previously displayed in the advanced layout. Although this layout does away with the enhanced design of color and icons, it is important to note the modules found within the red highlight box have been condensed in the advanced layout under the module title, Getting Started. The expansion of those items found within the foundational layout is a subtle difference. The foundational layout is the only layout in which you will have week 1 through 16 placeholders for content. In the other layouts, you will have to duplicate the weekly module if you would like to continue to use it. Lastly, as we can see, the abstraction of color and icons makes this course very distinct from the advanced layout. 
Some may prefer to keep it simple, perhaps, or others might want to get their hands dirty and try personalizing their course with color and icons of their own. As we proceed to the quick start layout, we'll notice the content has been heavily condensed. The Getting Started module is the only module in existence. Choosing what content to include next is truly up to you. Thank you so much for choosing ATS to learn about the various layout options. We absolutely hope this can aid your process and course builds. Please do not forget, ATS is always available for extra support. You can further get a hold of us at our ATS Zoom virtual hours, Monday through Thursday from 9 to 6, and Friday from 9 to 5. You can also email us at beachboard at csulb.edu. We look forward to hearing from you.